Welcome back to Let's Play Bastion. I'm Burning Dog Face. And, uh. Oh, for God's sake. There! You happy now? And we're here in Rothus Lagoon. Trying not to be eaten by Queen Anne. The last of the Ankle Gators. Brushers Pike. I was wondering why I hadn't heard of these brushers before. Because we hadn't encountered their weapon yet. The brushers use their pikes to keep their distance around here. Now the kid can do the same. Hmm. I do like this thing. Sharp sticks make Queen Anne nervous, so she backs off a bit. Hey, what? Stones. Kid's got a mean throwing arm. Don't mind if I do. Takes longer to reload than the, uh, to reload than the sword. I don't feel like this music fits at all. Look, look, I'm in the top. Oh. Yoink. Most of those peckers are smart enough to stay out of Queen Anne's way. Well, if that's the case, then now I need to go. Fuck. Well, no, not that. I need. I was gonna go back and check out the other area of tall grass. Alas. Those pin cushions been living off the ankle gator scraps. Oh fuck. Oh shit. I do like this. Queen Anne can't fit down some of these narrow paths. I'm not sure. Look how thin. Look at the height of the ground here. I'm not sure how she fits at all. I think the rest of her body would just be hanging down under the world. Or over the world, given that we can see the ground down there. Jesus! Queenie leads the kid into some kind of twisted trap. Oh, I don't like this one bit. One bad step in that tall grass, and he's Queen Anne's lunch. Noted. Right, I don't know why I stopped. Come on, kill yourself with your own spikes, it'll be great. No ah! idea to walk in gator grass. Didn't think, didn't think I did. Queen Anne cannot be harmed yet. Oh, my leg. Oh, fuck it. Okay, you're dead. He holds his ground. Seems the Queen's running out of options. Wow. I should feel pretty good with that. Uh, oh. Still no sign of the shard. 
Brusher's Pike. Thrusting melee weapon. Powerful medium range weapon can also be thrown. Fearless Ceylondian huntsmen use the business ends of these beauties to probe the capabilities of the flora and fauna lurking beyond the city walls. I wonder why this spearhead has those uh, semicircles taken out of it. Sneaky decoy. A decoy kit that draws foes' attention, rendering its owner nearly invisible and setting up a critical strike. Rusher has got many a target unawares of this technique. Here's the one I got from the, uh... From winning at the, uh... The Proving Grounds. Fuck. I'm gonna go with that. Looks like you have to let go just before the, uh, the, the flash of light. The closer you get to an ankle gator's lair, the thicker the tall grass grows. Kids oh, yeah. gotta make a run for it. Oh, I don't want that to happen, though. Those leaping lunkheads don't like Queen Anne any better than the kid. They make a tasty snack. That old gator's right on his tail. Damn it, my timing wasn't so good that time. Oh! Oh, I thought I was going this way. What the fuck is up here? Oh god, no! I really don't like this. This is really uncomfortable. Queen's got one mean bite. I wish I had that uh, decoy thing now. <clears throat> no, she can probably tell. Ah, oh, run, run! The best I could do. Queenie must have scared a bunch of peckers out of hiding. I don't know how stupid that thing is. Best not to feed the local wildlife. Good line. Seems even stinkweeds know to stay away from the queen. Shoo! Go away! Check off! Well, this wouldn't be an upgrade with the pocket watches. Something pointy. An upgrade material for the brusher display. A strip of knife bark, aged to perfection. Feared and respected by blacksmiths and woodcutters. Hey, lady, you missed. Oh. Oh, it's water. I don't mind if I do. Yeah, let's do something stupid. Ankle gator egg. Ankle gators don't much care for their young. That's why there ain't many around. Oh. I'm sad. Ankle Gator Egg, a memento. It is very large and heavy, and the occupant sounds to be alive. Ankle Gators are thought to be extinct because their eggs took decades to hatch and were easy prey. The Calamity must have unearthed this one. I don't know, maybe we can preserve the species of the Bastion or something. Wanna know how to find an Ankle Gator lair? You use a kid as bait. No! I don't want that to happen. Now she's coming for him. She's got nowhere else to go. 
The shard sitting in plain view. I see that. They say if you run across an ankle gator, you better keep running. Oh. No. No. What? Where the hell is the out? Okay, there. Not ideal, but you know. No! I feel like a giant, uh, teardrop. Honestly, I feel bad for Queen Anne. She's starting to get annoyed. Last of her kind and all that. Wait, the thing is open. The, uh, the skyway. I could just go. <sighs> I feel like I'm supposed to kill the, uh, the gator. Ah! And now he's made him mad. Oh, God, why? Rest in peace, Queen Anne. That was for the brushes. Oh! Stab Synth! I killed her with counter damage. So where the fuck is the path? Not clear at all. Kids done what needed to be done. Queen Anne's reign is over. We even got a crown jewel. Hello, what are you? Hmm. Ankle gator egg. Ask Zia about the massive egg from Rothus Lagoon. Do you think an ankle gator could be tamed? That gator's a crazy gal. But so is the gal who promised to look after her. Ankle Gator Egg. Ask about the massive egg from Rothos Lagoon. Ever seen anything like this before? They said Queen Anne was just a folk tale. Now there's living proof she ain't. Uh, hey there, little guy. Come. <laughs> no way! <laughs> oh, I am receiving a phone call. Just a moment. It was, uh... Oh, I didn't actually stop my timer, did I? Whoops! I'll, uh, add a few minutes to that then. <laughs> Oop, told him to stay. Oh. What's this? Oh, yeah, 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 upgrades, duh. Reinforced shaft, 15% critical hit chance. Uh, study, a study, a sturdy length of Zulwood that provides superior striking capability.
faster throw reload. That would be nice. Uh, hollowed shaft. A light, pliable length of Zol wood, perfectly balanced for throwing. Oh, I don't know. There's just so much. So many uh, things to do. And it looks like. Since you, it doesn't seem like you can redo old areas, I'm not sure how it's possible to afford them all. I'll make sure to save up my money for the ones I know I'm going to use. Oh, I just realized I was actually panning over the hammer and the gun as I did that. Oh, she's cute now. Just you wait. Pike Vault. Rusher's Pike Skill. A dexterous trick. A dexterous trick. I'm sure that's a typo. With which the wielder leaps into the sky to crash down on unsuspecting foes. Rusher's adapted this uh, maneuver from great war stories passed down from older generations. I'm not going to lie, I was expecting a new one. All that trouble for a single shard. But you know what? It was worth it. There's a memorial. You know, because more uh, things to do. Or the, uh, the lost and found. Mmm. Decisions, decisions. We need an awful big lost and found under the circumstances. You raise a good point. Something wrong. A flake of unusual rock, unseen prior to the calamity. It writhes at the slightest touch. It feels like bone, only heavier. Nasty! Bull brandy, plus 15% damage resistance. Viscous uh, beverage brewed as an offering to pith, known for promoting longevity and for resistance to pain. Seems very useful. Graver gimlet, plus 5% chance to turn zealous after defeating a foe. While zealous, gain plus 200% damage for 3 seconds. Photosensitive beverage with a mild chalky flavor, brewed underground. Potent effects come and go unpredictably. Leech aid. Ugh. Gain some health by striking foes. Side effect, minus 66% health tonic potency. Intense sour flavor known for its uh, invigorating effects. Bitter taste lingers for hours. Mender mead. Gain some health by counterblocking of the bullhead shield. Filled with herbs and vitamins that promote wellness, fragrant herbal bouquet. You lied. Oh no, it uh, was uh, exclusive spirits. Never mind. I was thinking something else. I think I do actually want the uh, damage resistance. That sounds really nice. It wasn't fixed. It was unbroken. Pardon me. Bull brandy is thicker than paint. Makes your skin feel as tough as knife bark. I wonder. Yeah, you can just take two guns if you want. Fuck am I looking at? Notice it says well balanced melee weapon, thrusting melee weapon, uh, dual ranged weapons, wide angle ranged weapon, fast attack melee weapon, versatile ranged weapon, rapid fire ranged weapon. Hmm. Oh yeah. Heavy duty hammers such as this constructed Ceylondia's famous rippling walls and protected them from elements and foes alike. 
I do kind of like the spear. I just wonder if it's, uh, if I should just be focusing on one weapon and investing heavily in that. Uh, if that's the case, I've probably made a mistake by buying as many upgrades as I have, but... I don't know, maybe the game is a lot longer than I get the impression of. I did turn that off before I went to do the, uh, who knows where. Oh! Well then, in that case, silence you. So that's two domesticated animals. Three if you include the steam bowl. Turn him round and round all you like. Pith's still gonna be ugly. Hmm. <laughs> yeah, I can't still do that. Or maybe it would just say, No, nah, you're all out of special tobacco. Or all out of wacky tobacco. I don't know. I'm Burning Dog Face, and I'll see you in the next episode of Let's Play Bastion. We're doing a good job of rebuilding this place. And re-energizing this place, but uh, we still got a fair amount of work ahead of us. I'll see you next time when that journey continues. Later!